Greetings YouTube, welcome back to the channel. I will admit that on paper, it's probably a pretty dumb move. Probably a pretty dumb decision to rush this. I always talk about patience, even with a new level up event at the time of recording this. Of course, it won't go on to my channel until several hours later after it's uploaded, processed, and all that fun YouTube stuff. Um, I have one new champion, as you can see. One. And that new champion is a six star that when I scroll all the way down, let's see if you can spot him. Now, one of the things I like to do is tell people that if you want to save on some tier four class catalyst, what you want to do is open some before you rank somebody up because it's my firm belief that the algorithm knows what you have the least of in a class and will often give you everything but that class or at least most other classes but that class. So my uh, science catalysts are about to be used up big time. But you see, I am a hoarder. I have over 27 more uh, tier four class catalysts than 500. So we're going to open 20 of them right now. 20. And we got two science. We're going to open another 10 got four signs. Now I might be wrong, but I have a feeling if I had not opened those four uh, right now, or I should say those 20 now with four, I would probably have not opened so many signs. So I tried to trick the algorithm, as strange as that sounds, and in my inventory you'll now see that I have an overflow of cosmic, an overflow of mutant, a lot of overflow of mutant actually, probably too many. Uh, Science and, uh, well, skill is right at 30. That's kind of exciting. Tech still needs some help. And uh, so does Mystic. All right, well, here goes nothing. We're about to have some fun ranking him up and then doing what I'm sure the thumbnail has previewed, for those of you who are nice enough to click on it, a good old-fashioned risk. Because what oftentimes happens when you open up a champion is that if you use an Awakening Gem, you actually get him right after. But the thing is, about this particular champion, who I hate fighting, I want to utilize him immediately in Battlegrounds. And the only way I'm going to do that is if I Awaken him. And even though he is one of those that seriously benefits from being SIG 200, that's not going to happen anytime soon. So... I might have to uh, have a goal of him being SIG 200, but start at SIG 2. So let's hit the old rank up. And this is going to be where I start to burn units. Because he's going to get, well, to the end of rank 2. And then suddenly, I need to start purchasing some rank up resources. You know, I did a video on Saturday about how the Black ISO store is okay but the glory store is really out of date and how tier 5 basic and tier 2 alpha especially if you purchase say daily paragon specials um those are probably the better way to put your glory in terms of overall value and price because the tier 6 basic and tier 3 alpha that you get from a paragon daily special is now the same that you get from one round each of the glory store which seems crazy to me and yet that's exactly where we're at in 2023. I think they should double that minimum, and maybe they will, but I don't expect them to, to update it anytime soon. The Paragon Daily Special really has made so many other things in the game not as valuable, which I guess was Kabam's goal, right? So I talked about how I needed to uh, purchase some rank up resources. Check this out. I have enough tier five basic, but not enough tier two alpha. So I am, yes, going to go to the Catalyst store because what I like to do is rank up when I can enough for 660 and then I'm even going to purchase, let's go, I've got 683 units above 50,000. So let's go with, uh, let's go with five. Left with 83 units. I like to have that when things are fun. I like to have that as like a barometer of what I can spend. It's like a budget. I'm not saying that's healthy, but that's me. <laughs> for better or for worse. 
All right, now all of a sudden, look at that. We're doing pretty good. And we will be now in a position. Let's take him to rank three. But the big thing is, of course, awakening him, which I can still feel people just dying on the inside when they see me use a generic. But I've got three. So I might save one for Iron Doom and then save the last one for a real special circumstance. The thing about having such a big roster, because I've been blessed with YouTube funding the ability to have fun on this channel and really go crazy with crystals at times and buy all the you know specials and other things that I'm so blessed to be able to do because of the revenue of this channel uh, and also because my quote unquote real job actually uh, pays the bills. It's fun when your hobby can be like fun money. I don't know why I put that in quotes. All right, so pretty low PI. Don't have enough resources to take him to rank four even if I wanted to, but you know what I do have. <laughs> I'm going to use that generic. I just tapped it. And then I have one six stone thanks to hero use. And so he is currently sig two. But I'm excited. Mama Bear doesn't have him. She has Iron Doom. It's one thing I can sort of have over her. Which is exciting for me. and Maybe that means my life is pathetic. I don't know. But I'm excited. Thanks for watching this video. Thanks for clicking on it. Have a good one.